I mean, I feel like we were all kind of expecting just a monster turn up for Edmonton in their last home game of the year. Holy smokes, that was just insanity. Um, Multiple players with multiple points tonight. Tons of offense coming in from the back end. Paul Coffey officially has company. Evan Bouchard becomes the second Oilers defenseman in Oiler history to reach the 80-point plateau. That is insanity. I've also given him way less flack over the last like month, month and a half due to just accepting the fact that he's always just going to be a fourth forward out there, driving the play, driving the puck, moving it up the ice, so is what it is. The guy's just contributing so much in the score column, and you need goals to win. As much as you need to prevent goals, you need goals to win. But we're not done there. Stick taps to Connor McDavid as well. For the second time in this game, an Oilers player joins an Oilers legend in the record books. Connor McDavid joins absolute royalty, reaching 100 assists in a single season. And who better to tuck it home than Zach Hyman himself? The dude is having an outstanding season, and we're probably going to say that every single year of his contract that he's here in Edmonton. So yeah, stick taps all around from the Oilers bench, stick taps from Oilers faithful, from Oilers nation, from oil country, stick taps all around. And also, some very important stick taps to Georgi Romanov. The goalie comes in after 8-1, granted, but he comes in and he gets his first taste of NHL hockey. That's pretty special. You can't take that away from him, no matter what the score is. And what I really loved is after he made his first save and he gloved that down as we're going to TV timeout, he tosses the puck out to the ref. The ref comes out and says, hey man, like welcome to the show. And then Romanov gives him a little stick tap as he skates off. Like I just, I love seeing that. It's so cool that no matter what the outcome is of the game, you can't take away the fact that a very, very small percentage of people have ever played NHL minutes in an NHL game and he's one of them. So welcome to the show. That's pretty cool. But yeah, stick taps all around. What a crazy, crazy night. What a crazy, crazy season. Stick taps to you, the viewers that tune in. It's been a little over a year of making these insane videos, and they started pretty poorly. Oh my goodness. Not saying that they got much better, let's be real. But for how the season started especially, kudos to all of you that tuned in to watch an Euler fan just lose his goddamn mind. Thank you for losing yours with me, but thank you for coming back to watch Edmonton be the best team in the National Hockey League since November. They have been absolutely unstoppable in absolute force. Everybody was just solid. Like, what can you expect? Nine even strength goals, too, from Edmonton. Nine. That's insane. Thank you guys so, so, so very much for watching. We'll tune in for the next couple games to close out the season, Arizona and Colorado. But that's it for me, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.